roads across the metro. Between January and June this year, 95 people lost their lives in fires in Cape Town. 13 of these were informal houses. The acquisition of these new vehicles forms part of a replacement program instituted more than a decade ago and which is now nearing completion. New technology and design instrumental in ensuring an improved service to communities. The ability that these vehicles give now just gives us the, the firefighters a little bit more technical expertise um, and also to access areas that we weren't able to access before um, and also in terms of the, the water shortages that we had uh, two or three years ago um, with the extra water tankers and the and also the, the, the vandalization or, or the vandalizing of our uh, street items, um, our water sources are, are critical in terms of being able to get them there as soon as possible and to get them as close to the fires. These new technical rescue vehicles boast extra equipment including battery operated jaws of life, technical rope rescue and decontamination equipment. The camera equipment is uh, particularly in, in uh, building collapse situations um, and also in uh, earthquake situations. Um, the camera equipment also allows you to record what you're doing and then also somewhere where staff can't get to. You can get into uh, awkward places with them by using the camera and, and, and basically TV technology so that you can try and locate patients a lot better. Cape Town's fire services are kept busy. They've responded to over 6,100 vegetation fires between January and the end of August, and over 15,000 incidents in total, including dwellings alight, medical emergencies and animal rescues. Most of our water tankers in Cape Town are quite old, many of them in excess of 20 years or more, with very high mileage, and they're now constantly in for repair. Um, they also suffer damages from when there are attacks on the vehicles during protest actions when they respond to fires and some members of the community uh, cause damage to the vehicles uh, and so this is uh, 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 an absolute godsend. The city says its firefighting vehicle numbers are now in a much better situation than it's been in years with 68 fire trucks, 28 water tankers, 26 skid units and 19 bush tenders forming part of the fleet. Vanessa Puna, SABC News, Cape Town.